you told us from the beginning, Chuck, 5G consumer is now what you're about. It's 5G enterprise, then subsequently delayed because of COVID. People are starting to go back to the office. Yes, there's still people, like Greg Hayes is saying to Raytheon, 50% of people might have come back. But I don't know, in a lot of businesses that you have big customers, they're coming back. What will that mean for enterprise spending in Cisco? Well, Jim, we're seeing it now. Over the last couple of quarters, we've seen significant investment in next generation wireless infrastructure to be ready for their employees to come back to the office. And we said that as you load these wireless networks, they're going to need campus refresh underneath them. And we've seen exactly that. We've seen the Catalyst 9000 platform, four consecutive quarters of increasing growth sequentially. And uh, we're really seeing the impact of this hybrid work model, the preparation for hybrid work and the return to office. I think we're seeing it. It seems to be that customers are, are absolutely believing this is going to occur and they're investing into it. Well, Chip, what's to explain the fact that the Americas really weren't that strong versus other areas that, frankly, I would have expected to be weaker than America? Well, if you think about what we saw in Asia, is Asia was the first to go into the pandemic. So they're, they're coming out heavily uh, investing. In the Americas, we have, uh, we have Latin America, which is continuing to struggle but we saw significant strength across commercial, across public sector, and across service providers. So we think that it's going to continue improving over the next several quarters. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at CNBC.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.